Hi, I'm Mike. Uh, today we're going to tell you something about uh, autumn shrubs uh, for November, five of the best. Now that autumn's properly kicked in, uh, getting a little bit cooler now and the, the leaves have mostly dropped, uh, interest turns from uh, autumn foliage that's to some really nice evergreens and nice burying plants. Uh, the first one we've got here is a fantastic leucotho uh, called Curly Red. As you can see, really interesting curly, wavy leaf form. And the good thing about leucothos is that they are turn even brighter colours as it gets colder. This plant here is called uh, Butyberry, uh, otherwise known as Calicarpa. And you can see why it's called Butyberry, because these fantastic, real deep purple berries. There's nothing else like this which gives you such a fantastic berry. Uh, it's quite unusual plant to see. The berries stay on the, the bush for a good long time through autumn and winter. They're not really that, that interesting to birds, so they're going to stay fantastic in your, in your garden. It also has the extra benefit of, of attractive autumn foliage in sort of like yellow and purplish tints. This is one of the best uh, colourful plants through the winter uh, by Burnham Tynus Lisa Rose. Uh, carries these flower buds uh, all through until spring with some opening all through the winter and autumn. Um, but these lovely deep red flower buds turning, turning to pink before eventually opening to white flowers. It's a tall plant and grow up to three meters, so great for a hedge, but it can also be kept fairly small by pruning regularly. Uh, this Christmas box, uh, Sarka Cocker Winter Gem, is a new variety that's, uh, that's been really very popular. Uh, it's a bit one for a bit later. Plant this now for colour and scent in January. These little flower buds will open to little white flowers with a fantastic scent. Plant it near your, your back door or your front door, somewhere where you'll go in the, in the winter. Uh, they'll reward you with a fantastic clouds of perfume on the air. Finally, Schemia japonica is a well-known and uh, plant which is well used for its, its fantastic red flower buds that keep, keep uh, on the plant through the winter, opening to uh, scented flowers in spring. Uh, an ericaceous plant, it loves an, an acid compost, but it'll go really well in either a pot or in the ground. As long as you get the acidification right, you should be absolutely fine with this, giving you a whole load of colour through winter. So even though it's cold now, it's getting a bit chilly, uh, it's worth getting out in your garden to, to give you some good uh, interest in your garden when the rest of the garden is asleep. Uh, come and get, get your, your gloves on and get planting.